Hey, how's it going everybody? So in today's video, we're going to be talking about the chords that we find um, in the key of C major. So there's six common chords that we use. Well, although there's seven, I'm going to show you six of them today. First chord is called a C chord. What you do is you take your ring finger, you go to the third fret of string five right here. Take your middle, go to the second fret of string four. Take your index, go to the first fret of string number two. Strings three and one will be left open. All open means is that you still end up playing the string, but you don't end up pressing into the fret. I mean, I mean you don't end up pe pressing into any of the frets of that string. So if you were to strum all your strings open, if you were to strum all your strings like this, you just played every single string open. So our first chord, C chord. Our next chord is called D minor. Now what we do is we take the middle, we go to the second fret of string three, the ring finger goes to the third fret of string two, and the index goes to the first fret of string one. Sometimes you can swap the ring finger with the pinky if it's more comfortable, it's totally fine to do that. Our next chord is going to be one of the easiest one out of all of them. We take our middle and our ring, we end up going to the second frets of strings five and four. This is called an E minor chord. Sometimes people will also hold it using the index and middle, that's okay. I like to use the middle and ring finger for it though. Our next chord is going to be a little tricky. We have to do a bar chord. This one is called F major. It sounds like this. What we do is we take the ring finger, we go to the third fret of string five. Take the pinky, we go to the third fret of string four. The middle, second fret of string three. Then the index is going to bar. So what that means, it's, it's a technique for the guitar. In other words, we have to use one finger when we press down multiple strings at the same time. In this case, we're going to be pressing down strings two and one at their first fret. Sometimes it can be a little tough to get that first string to ring out, so you can kind of imagine just trying to like squeeze a little bit of the string, try to press it into the wood of the guitar like this. So moving into our next chord, a G chord. This one we go to the third fret of string six with the middle, second fret of string five with the index, third fret of string two with the ring, third fret of string one with the pinky. We get this sound. Our last one is called A minor. Middle goes to the second fret of string four, ring goes to the second fret of string three, and index goes to the first fret of string two. String one and five are left open. So we get this. So again, we had C, D minor, E minor, F major, G major, and A minor. Hope this helps.